this Ford Mustang, they introduced it in 2007, it felt like it had speed, it felt like it had performance, but it never sounded like that. The factory exhaust system was built for your grandmother. No sound anywhere, under full acceleration anywhere. And as we did research on it, there were so many systems that would give you the inside cabin drone. You'd have good sound while under acceleration. By cruising at 65 or 70, you couldn't stand the drone, the noise in the cabin. So we went to Borla. They told us about their multi-core exhaust system. We got the great sound, it was built for racing, came right off the race cars without the drone in the cabin. That's what we were looking for. Uh, you don't uh, have to cut anything, you don't have to weld anywhere. Uh, you've got bolt-on, big-time hangers. Uh, BJ had it all in there and uh, running down the road in uh, less than a half hour. I think the thrill was uh, after uh, uh, B.J. Fisher put it in at Genesis 1, we rode behind him and you could see the undercarriage. You could see how everything fit. It looked like a factory installation uh, with big time sound. Put the boiler exhaust on. Uh, Totally, uh, I think it gave us more performance, more power, but it gave us the sound that we now feel we're driving a high performance, high tech vehicle. The, the sound is very, very unique now, very different. Uh, I've had a lot of hot rods. I don't think I've had a car sound like this car sounds. This car sounds uh, uh, better than anything we have in our collection at this time. People that are real uh, race enthusiasts thinks my boiler system uh, makes the car sound like I'm under carburation rather than fuel injection. It doesn't sound like an old, old hot rod. It sounds like a high-tech muscle car. And the boiler can give you 7 to 10 percent increase in horsepower along with the good sound. Help your Ford GT500, help your performance car. Uh, the factory will never do what Borla does and uh, increase your horsepower and give you that great sound. <laughs>